Notably, thousands of demonstrators from across Italy staged a rally in Rome on Saturday to protest against the government's decision of the use of mandatory face masks and compulsory vaccinations for school children. The protest took place near Rome's iconic landmark of Bocca della Verita, or the Mouth of Truth monument, where more than a thousand people waved the national flag and carried banners to voice their opinions. Protesters comprised members of the far-right party Forza Nuova, the anti-vaccination activists as well as local bikers and taxi drivers from the area. Demonstrations have called the mandatory enforcement of face masks a limitation to personal freedoms. In an effort to prevent the spread of COVID-19, the Italian government has imposed compulsory use of face masks for children in schools. Children will be required to use masks while entering and leaving school premises and even within corridors. However, it will not be mandatory in classrooms. Meanwhile, Italian Prime Minister Giuseppe Conti said that he has no words for those who deny the coronavirus pandemic except to look at the numbers of rising cases. During an interview, Conti mistakenly said that 135,000 were dead due to COVID-19 instead of the 35,000 deaths, which is the official figure of fatalities in the country from coronavirus. So che ci sono, oggi credo ci sia una manifestazione a Roma di persone che pensano che la pandemia non esista. A loro rispondiamo con i numeri. 274.000, oltre 274.000 contagiati e 135.000 circa decessi. Punto. Punto. 35, 35.000. 135.000, 134.000, 135.000 decessi. Punto. Italy's daily case surge after dropping down to below 200 during the summer months reached nearly 1,700 on Saturday. Now, this was perhaps one of the biggest jumps in daily case loads since the month of May.